everyone, our new all-in-one marking machine has been produced. Let's take a look at it. This is the column of the machine. This is the accessories bag for the machine. This is the laser head of the machine. This is the main body of the machine in the box. A laser head, a column, and a base. This is the hexagonal wrench in the accessory box. There are various sizes for assembling the machine. This is the aluminum foil card in the accessory box. You can use it for experimental markings and adjusting the optical path, or for beautiful markings on it. It is a very practical item. This is the USB cable in the accessory box, mainly used to connect the computer and the machine. This is the power cord in the accessory box, used to power the machine. This is the foot pedal switch in the accessory bag that replaces the label buttons on your computer. And you can use it to control the machine. This is the USB flash drive in the accessory bag, which contains the software installation package, parameter screenshots, and software drivers. This ruler in the accessory bag can measure the items you need to mark, as well as the focal length of the lens. This is our protective glasses, protecting us from the dangers of lasers. These keys are used for safety switches of laser sources. You insert the key here to turn on the laser source and make it work. These two fixings are used to fix some small objects on the workbench. You can fix them on the table with screws. Like this. There are four screws in the accessory bag that are used to fix the bracket. This is all that's in the box. Fix the column at the designated position on the base and secure it with tools. Same thing on the other end. Next, fix the laser head and remove the original screws on the laser head. Align the removed screws with the screw holes and tighten them. Finally, reinforce with tools. This is what it looks like after assembly. First, plug one end of the power cord into the machine and the other end into the socket. Light on to indicate power is on. Connect the USB port and plug the USB cable into the machine. Connect the other end to the computer. Release the emergency stop button, insert the key and start the machine. red light preview before working. Then shape the column to make the laser at the focal length. Just like this, you can start working. Note, before starting work, make sure the lens protective cover has been removed. Open the software and start preparing the pattern or text we want to mark. After setting the parameters, you can start marking. Okay, the final test is completed, and there is no problem. Turn off the machine.